Good morning children. Today we shall learn more about cells. We already know that cells can be of different shapes and sizes like round cell, long string like cell, rod like cell etc. Cells not only form the body of the organism but it is also a functional unit. We can say cells have a lifespan. They are born, they grow and they die too. Now let us look into a cell. A living cell is like a small piece of jelly with a coating. This coating is the cell membrane. That jelly like part is cytoplasm in the cell. The cell membrane separates a cell from other cells. It also controls wisely what goes in and what goes out of the cell. There is a round or nearly round dense part in the cytoplasm which is called nucleus. It is generally spherical and located in the center of the cell. The nucleus is separated from the cytoplasm by a membrane called the nuclear membrane. You know, nucleus is the very important part of the cell and most of the living cells have nucleus. Robert Brown observed the presence of nucleus in different cells in 18th century. See, this is the microscopic view of onion peel. Each cell has cytoplasm, round nucleus and cell membrane. The cell membrane gives shape to the cell. Just like there are many organs which do different tasks in our body, there are many parts in the cytoplasm which perform different tasks. These are organelles. Each organelle has one or more specific function. Like here, there is an organelle named mitochondrion. Plural of mitochondrion is mitochondria. This is known as the powerhouse of the cell as it participates in cell metabolic functions and produces power from food. Ribosome is another cell organelle which produces protein. There are many organelles in the cell which perform different functions. Sometimes we see blank space like thing in the cell as if there is a vacuum placed in the cell. That structure is called vacuole. Some cells have many small vacuoles. Many plant cells have big vacuole. Vacuoles are actually storage bubbles which may store nutrients, waste etc. So cells are so tiny but really amazing. That was all about cell and the parts of cell. Bye bye children.